Hello guys, I'm going to show you how to make star rating in React.js. At the first step, let's go to our components directory if you don't have created and create a component called starrate.js so we can work with. Okay, at the first step, let's import React as always from React. And after importing, we need to export our function like export default function the name of the component which is star rate Oops. okay star rate and inside the function we need to return the template parentheses and don't forget to add these fragments as well okay and here we need to uh, actually display five stars so let me create a five star array like this uh, sorry an array of size five and then map it on the HTML and uh, the argument is the star inside the error function we should return the template okay and what we need to display is a, an icon called fast star which is imported uh, inside one of the font awesome libraries and uh, let me import it file star from the library is react icons and uh, the folder is file okay and uh, this is going to actually display a uh, star for us let me import the component inside after js so we can take a look and check on it Star it and then add the tag. All right, save the changes and let's take a look. Yeah, as you can see, five stars are displaying on the screen for us. Next thing is to actually make the stars dynamic to add some inputs. And let me add a fragment here so we can wrap everything inside. Okay, and then paste it inside. All right, great. The input should be of type radio, so we can actually uh, check and uncheck them. Mm -hmm. And uh, we also need to dedicate some name for input, like maybe rate. Uh -huh. And uh, we also need a label for each input. And the label is going to be uh, this icon. So we need to cut, uh, cut and paste the icon tag inside label. Mm -hmm. Perfect. But in order to make everything more convenient for ourselves, uh, let me wrap the input inside the label as well. So we can actually uh, do whatever we want and implement any logic on the labels, which are the stars. And the logic is that we need to color some stars, so we need to uh, know which index we need. Let me add an argument called index here, so we can actually access the index. And uh, let's store it in a const variable called current rate. And uh, current rate is index plus one because indexes start with zero. We need a state to store it locally in our function. Let's call the state rating and the set state is set rating. And this is going to be a use state and initial value is null. All right. And what we should do here is to uh, set the value of the input to the current value. So whatever the rating is, that many stars are colored, okay? And we also need to add this onClick method to set that uh, rating actually. So we know what the uh, rating is. Let's say set rating is going to be the current rate, which is the index plus one. All right. Well, as you can see, uh, if I click on them, nothing happens because uh, there's no sign actually. We need to change the color to witness some change. 
Let me increase the size at first, okay? And then we need to set the color to this logic. The logic is going to be if the current rate was less than or equal uh, the rating. Uh, we, we can also add a color rate here. Let me add a state like rate color and set color is a use state. It's going to help us a wish star should be colored. Okay, if current rate was less than or equal the rating of the color should be something like yellow, which means they are actually active, unless the star should be gray. All right. Um, why did I say hover here? Oh no, it should be red color. Okay. As you can see, it is working perfectly, and uh, the star's rating is ready. But let me style it a little bit to make it look like this. And uh, yeah, this is how you can make a star rating in React.js. That's pretty easy and straightforward. Thanks for watching.